Gorge to be easy again today because we're celebrating, um, I love French toast. We're celebrating that today. French, so toast, French toast is toast good. Day. But if you combine that with one of my favorite desserts in all of Amarillo, your bread pudding, then you've got magic. Whoop, whoop. Yep. All and right. We, so we're going to French toast it. Okay. Tell me Tim. that's not awesome. That's awesome. All right. Okay. So, so what, it, Andy's got three eggs. He's going to crack an egg. I just like watching Andy crack eggs. You want eggs. me to crack an egg? Crack an egg, hey, Andy. Um, Let's see. Let me tell you, I'm getting better at it. You are getting better at it? Can you do it one handed? Yes. Let's you see, see it. it. One handed egg cracking. Any shells? Any shells? Nope. There you go, Andy. Look at that. God, you I've advanced. I can't even, like, do I, I, know. I feel like, you know, like it's, a it's kid. A moment. So, do I need <laughs> all of these eggs in here? Uh, you could just, no, you're good right okay. now. All right, so you're going to whisk this together. And basically, guys, we, uh, we, we're. You can get the bread pudding recipe. Right now, what we're showing you is the basic how to French toast it. Yeah, and this is, everybody kind of has their own thing, yes. but it's, your, it's kind of some simple ingredients And here. we're going to add some sugar to it. Okay. All right, because I like to sweeten it up a little bit. Some people don't add sugar to bread pudding. Cinnamon, of course, because mm. you want that cinnamon. I like to add uh, vanilla paste because, you know, I like that you Madagascar. You love that Madagascar. Smell this. It's so good. It's so good. So we're going to add, guys, if you can use fine Madagascar vanilla paste over vanilla extract, use it. Life-changing. Now, it, you've been using that for, I mean, we've been doing Studio 4 for a long time. You brought that on moons ago. I know. What year did the show start? I think we've been doing it longer than eight years now or something That's like that. That's what I think it yeah. is. Isn't it crazy? Yeah. Crazy. And wow. I always get to come back. And, I know. We love it to get to know? catch up on you. But That's I come fun. in your restaurant because I love it. So I get to see you there. I know. I'm excited. Now I'm back in. We're coming back in on Friday night. Look out. Friday night they're coming in. We're going to have shark. Blackfin shark. So if you guys have never tried shark, we have a uh, shark that will be flying in on Friday. That's exciting. Uh, we just got Dungeness crab right now at the restaurant. Mm. So and they are fantastic. I may have to do that. Too. Okay. So the last thing we need to add is some milk to this. You're not done whisking, okay. sir. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our French toast. Uh, we're gonna take our bread pudding. Now guys, when you make the bread pudding, I suggest when you're doing it to keep it cold because if you don't keep it cold, bread pudding tends to be very, very soft and it might fall apart. Fall apart on so you. I recommend keeping it refrigerated before we put it in the egg wash, okay. which we're going to do right, right now. Do, do we, we wanna do it now or do you wanna take a break? It's up to you. All right, let's do that. Let's take a quick break. We're gonna be back in the kitchen with Rory Shapizzi uh, celebrating National French Toast Day.